Well, a vessel carrying China's manned deep-sea submersible has set sail for the Mariana Trench in the Pacific Ocean. The Jialong plans to reach that trench on June 10th and begin preparations for a 7,000-meter dive. Our reporter Hu Tao was in Jiangyin in Jiangsu province to bid farewell to the crew there. A ceremony is held at Sunan port to bid farewell to Jialong and its mothership. Before the departure, Professor Cui Weicheng, Jialong's deputy chief designer, described the technology behind the vessel. Jialong boasts free hovering capability under the sea. Its propellers are highly advanced. It doesn't need any outside support to stay still. This makes the undersea operation much more convenient. In March this year, Hollywood director James Cameron dived to the bottom of the Mariana Trench. He spoke to Professor Cui and expressed his interest in Jialong. But Professor Cui pointed out that there is a big difference between Cameron's one-man submersible and Jialong. Cameron's submersible only allows one person in it, and it's mainly for personal adventure. Jialong is much bigger and capable of carrying out comprehensive scientific research under the ocean. They're different, but Cameron's submersible has more advanced lights and cameras, and we should learn from that. Fully equipped and well prepared, the mothership disappears into the horizon. If Xiaolong successfully completes the 7,000 meter test dive, China will become one of the few countries in the world to have independently developed this kind of deep water technology. Experts say that this will greatly increase China's competitiveness in the marine economy. Hu Chao, CCTV, Jiangsu Province.